Good evening guys. The latest NVIDIA GeForce Game Ready Driver came out today. And the version number is 497.29. So what has changed? What is new? Or what is better now? It's a small one, it's not a big one. Download and install for the definitive experience. Our latest GeForce Game Ready Driver ensures the best gaming experience in GTFO and Horizon Zero Dawn. Two games, better support now. Download our latest game loader, yeah, bloody bloody blah. GTFO, in GTFO your team is made up of prisoners under the command of the Omnius Warden. Now that's a new game. And Horizon Zero Dawn is now supported with NVIDIA DLSS. Guerrilla and Sony Interactive Entertainment is system enhanced PC port for the critically acclaimed Horizon Zero Dawn and has added NVIDIA DLSS. And now with up to 50% accelerated performance with DLSS. You have to try it. I know it's working and it's working great. New games supported by GeForce Experience Optimal Settings, that is the one click. And the new games Grand Theft Auto, the Trilogy, the Definitive, Definitive Edition, Cordis War Tales, World of Warcraft. But download it, install it. And what they have changed now in the game ready, this new game ready driver provides the best day one game experience for the latest new titles. And there are fixed issues in this release. Microsoft Flight Simulator, the game may crash to the desktop during gameplay. I had it a few times, it's now gone. Purple blue artifacts appear on ground textures in the game, also gone. Supreme Command. And desktop may stutter after extended period when mouse cursor is moved. And I had that. It was very annoying. And it's finished now. And if in a control panel, spelling error in the German language. Now that is in German. I don't use that. But for the German users in the German language, that's very important. And there are also open issues. The open issues will be open until they are fixed. In multi-monitor configuration the screen, the screen may display random black screen flicker. Yeah, I have it a little bit with multi-screen. And they are working on it. So, when you have troubles with this latest driver just for, don't forget to use DDU, Display Driver Uninstaller. You can also choose to make a clean install with this one. Try it out. And you can remember, you can always go back and you can always go back to this one. Sometimes it help, really helps with a clean install. With DDU, remove everything from NVIDIA and install it on new. And it will work perfectly. So the latest version is number 497.29. And the release date is today, the 20th of December 2021. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Don't forget to like it. Give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye and be safe.